All right, so I don't have anything lined up for today. Like, I mean, when you're watching this today. Um, today is Monday, it's Memorial Day, uh, and I have no vlog figured out. And uh, the reason for this is because I had actually recorded some stuff on Tuesday of last week and then Wednesday, but no, there was nothing interesting going on. And then me and Kirsten broke up. Oh no, it was like a week ago. So I like I just I started recording something and I just stopped recording, and so I don't have a vlog figured out for today. However, I am because the weather is supposed to be kind of weird for the next few days or whatever, um, but it's supposed to get nice again. Uh, I am gonna put out a new uh, parkour montage. I know my last one wasn't very good and it wasn't very long either. Uh, it was just me and Orion doing some kind of like weird stuff, like it wasn't like serious parkour. Um, and that's because we went to a park that wasn't really parkour oriented, nor was there a whole lot of stuff to do anyways. Um, so I have, but I, I actually learned some new things. So I learned how to do a turn vault over, over a rail. Uh, so instead of, well, I mean, if you're into parkour, then you know what a turn vault is. If you're not into parkour, you'll see what that, what a turn vault is. Uh, and I'll probably like label it on the screen, you know, so you can see like when the montage piece comes up, like, Hey, this is a turn vault. Uh, and then I learned how to do a front vault or Kong vault. Um, a lot better than I used to like well I say used to like I've been doing this for a while but I just recently learned how to do a Kong vault um, this uh, last Saturday so like two days ago and I was at Blake's school practicing and I finally did a Kong vault and uh, I, I was like astounded with myself and I was like super excited so I uh, went back to my house grabbed some recording stuff and then tried to record it just so I could see how it looked um, and the platform or the thing that I was that I was front vaulting over wasn't very good for front vaulting. Like it was really low to the ground. It was like my knee height, which isn't all that much anyways. It's like, you know, well actually I have a ruler. I'll tell you exactly how tall it is. That's almost a foot and a half. So from, if you can imagine a foot and a half, it's not very tall at all. So front vaulting over something that's like the, the height of your knee or about a foot and a half tall is not very tall at all. But then, uh, so then I went over to Ryan's house to practice front vaulting before he got out there because he was kind of busy with stuff. And uh, I front vaulted over those tables that you guys have seen in uh, past parkour videos, uh, which is crazy because that thing is like, is like if you take that foot and a half from my knees and you go up to about mid thigh, a little bit over mid thigh, that's like, you know, two feet, two and a half feet almost, you know? So that's like two, two, two and a half feet. That's another foot, foot and a half, or uh, yeah, about a foot higher than um, than the thing I, I learned how to do the front vault on. Um, and not only that, but it's also longer. My, the uh, thing that I was practicing on at Blake School is about as wide as my shoulders. Like it's about from like this shoulder to this shoulder or maybe a little bit more. And the uh, table at Ryan's house, or the park across the street from his house, is about, uh, like, I, I know you guys aren't gonna see get the same perspective, but it's about from, like, I guess this wall here, wall to about here, like the end of this thing here, which is a good few feet, is a safety vault. And, uh, and that's just kind of like almost vaulting over an object. Actually, I can probably show you guys a little bit right now. So it's like vaulting up onto something, but not vaulting over it, um, and just getting one leg up so you can kind of assess the area past the object that you're vaulting over, um, and then figuring out how I want to go about getting over this. And you can either slip your leg through and just like kind of continue on going, or you can turn around and land, you know, turn yourself onto an edge or something, or a ledge or whatever. So that, that's kind of some of the stuff that I've been practicing. Um, and I'm gonna have a, a montage that's way better than any of my other montages. Uh, and it's gonna be super, super fun. I'm probably gonna have Ryan and me doing some stuff. Um, and then him and I are actually gonna be taking a trip up to Portland here in the next few weeks, maybe the next month or so. We're going up to Portland. Uh, I'm gonna go up there to go actually see a friend of mine, um, but then I'm gonna be taking him up there uh, later on at a later time and we're gonna see what's down there. And there's a gym that's uh, relatively close to uh, my school, and then we're gonna go and see if we can get memberships there, if it's worth going, and if it's a good place to go and practice, so. But that's it for today's vlog. Uh, I know it's just 
recordings of my GoPro, like there's nothing of me at school or anything. Um, and that's just because I've been kind of distracted with some, you know, people been asking me what's going on with me and Kirsten and I don't want those in the video. And, um, I'm actually scheduled to get my license this uh, Thursday. So like the, the week that this goes up, this Thursday in two days, I'm going to be getting my, uh, my license. And so uh, I'll be able to drive places instead of just biking places or walking places or whatever or getting rides from people. So that's what's going on this week. Uh, I'll give you guys an update uh, next week on my um, on my license and everything. I will film some stuff with my license. I'll film stuff of me just driving alone. It'll be super cool, uh, for me at least. Um, and then we I'll have that montage up in the next week or so. So I uh, hope you guys all enjoyed today's video, and uh, I will see you guys next week.